Hey there, Lucas. So got uh, your parts here, so thanks for getting those through. Um, so you got barge one, barge two, and you need them on two points in the shore on each one. Um, so this is what I was coming up with initially. Um, the points stick to whatever ones you have them, like that. So depending on where you want uh, the barge to kind of drag towards. Um, they don't really rotate um, yet. I mean, you could do uh, free rotate, G, and then rotate it. And it'll stick to it. Um, the way I accomplished this is instead of uh, having a bunch of rope parts, um, you can have this one as a rope part. That doesn't really matter because it's not going to change. Um, you could do it in a sketch too, but that's fine with right there. Um, these ones I just created a regular sketch. And then this one I just drew uh, a random sketch around it. But uh, as far as this goes, I just created a sketch, um, projected the edges of this and the edges of that. Um, so this will stick to the actually outside edge of it. So if you had a point you know, somewhere, so like if you had your locking, let's say that's your main point here, um, set at some distance. So you could say, I want this, my docking point at 50, and this one at 80. So if you move it around, it's a fully defined sketch, but it's just to those points, whereas these ones, you could still drag them around. So depending on how you want to have it set up, um, you basically just come into here, say that one's 30 away, and that one's your other docking position at 90. So that way, if you're dragging your parts, are we fully defined now? I think so. Oops. That's why. So, I don't know if that's exactly what you're looking for, um, or if there's some sort of relation that these have to be, you know, that they'll straighten out, or if there's like a limiting angle um, as they go around. I don't know if you need to do like a spiral pattern, like a, you know, like a 3D printer where it'll come around all that um, that might get you going I don't really know what uh, you're trying to do but as far as that goes that's uh, yeah, my help